11 tonight. A teenager dies after falling seven floors down an elevator shaft located inside an abandoned hospital building. CBS 2's Matt Kozar has more now from the Tompkinsville section of Staten Island. Investigators say the 16-year-old was with his friends when he fell seven stories down an elevator shaft at this former hospital on Castleton Avenue that's been abandoned for the past 36 years. It all happened around 4.30 Friday afternoon. It's very dangerous. Sir. Nobody should be in there. Battalion Chief James Boylan says when firefighters arrived on the scene, they found signs of a forced entry. It was sealed up from the first floor, but it appears as though some people had breached uh, one side of the building to get in. This was once Staten Island Hospital, which closed its doors in 1979. It's unclear what the boy and his friends were doing at the dilapidated building, but other teens say it's a popular spot to hang out and explore. They're pretty much going in. Um, they're doing drugs. Tammy Walker lives across the street. They should have security, have a guard or have someone patrol the area every so often. But as soon as school is out, this is where people hang out. It's all too easy to gain access to this facility. We found multiple entry points all across the hospital. Reporting in Tompkinsville, Staten Island, Matt Kozar, CBS 2 News. And just moments ago, police identified the victim as 16-year-old Marcos Castillo.